Hello watch fans, Berth here watches here and this time for you we have a circa 1959 although I'm pretty sure it is 1959 Certina DS. Now 1959 was the first year that these models came out the technology was patented in 1958 so it can't be earlier than that and in 1960 they changed the movement Certina put a different movement in now this one has got the flat case back, no turtle, which the early ones should have, this flat case back. Inside it says Swiss pattern pending. It is an early one, without a shadow of a doubt. You've got these nice turned in lugs, similar to a Speedmaster, and that's no surprise because the case is made by HF, uh, Huguenin Bro uh, Freya Brothers. And the bracelet is also made by one of the best makers of bracelets and that's Geferes and it is the original clasp as well now they made bracelets for Patek, Oldemar Piguet, Rolex, everybody Zenith, Hoya, they are the bracelets to have and this one is a long one it's adjusted for my fat wrist and it's still got plenty of room on and we've cleaned it in our ultrasonic bath the dial is a little creamy, which goes well with the original Dauphine hands. Signed crown, all stainless steel construction, and this double shock DS system protecting the movement, so it's running well. There is a mystery to these, and that is why they're not more money. If this was a Universal Genève Polar Router, from about the same period, you'd pay double or more. If it was an Eterna Contiki, you would pay an awful lot more. And that's without going to brands that would use the same cases or uh, bracelets. You know, IWC used these bracelets. HF cases were in the original Speedmasters. So why is it less? I genuinely don't know. It's 36mm case, automatic, revolutionary, high quality ingredients. I'm pretty sure they won't be this price forever as more people discover them. In fact, I'm pretty sure that if you've tried to buy this bracelet for another watch, you might end up spending as much as you would on a watch. It's available now at berthierwatches.com and we've put a link in the comments below to help you find it. Thanks for watching.